For over a decade, the Burj Khalifa in Dubai has held the title of the world's tallest building. But that title is about to be challenged by a new generation of skyscrapers that are pushing the boundaries of what's possible in architecture and engineering. As we look to the future, the question is no longer how tall can we build, but how tall will we build? Join us as we explore the top seven future tallest buildings on Earth and the engineering marvels that will make them possible. But just before you get carried away by the wonders we are about to reveal in this video, click the subscribe button now and let's dive in. Number 6. Oblisco, Egypt The Oblisco Capital, reaching a towering height of 3,280 feet, is ready to surpass the Burj Khalifa and claim the title of the world's tallest structure. Designed as a pharaonic obelisk with a water canal resembling the Nile River, this monumental skyscraper on the central ring road of the new administrative capital will house residential units, hotels, malls, theatres, offices, hospitals and more across its 165 storeys. Set to be completed by 2030, the $3.2 billion project is financed through debt from the People's Republic of China to Egypt, constituting just 1% of the country's GDP. Commencing in 2024, the tower's six sections include a base housing ballrooms, meeting spaces, fine dining and shopping areas adorned with gilded interiors and intricately carved marble columns. To mitigate challenges, the tower incorporates air vents with Art Deco-style louvers, adjusting to the sun's trajectory for interior temperature control. The exterior features a motif inspired by the Egyptian lotus pattern, popular during the time of the pharaohs. As a mixed-use development, the Oblisco Capital spans residential, commercial, recreational, retail and sports complexes across its 165 floors and 13,500,000 square foot floor area. In addition to that, the construction poses unique challenges. These challenges include architectural complexity, adherence to Vision 2030 standards, ensuring sustainable practices, and addressing logistical and engineering obstacles inherent in such a project. Despite comparisons to other contenders like the Azerbaijan Tower, recent progress suggests the Oblisco Capital stands a better chance of completion. If realized, it will surpass the Burj Khalifa, reaching a height of one kilometer and almost doubling the One World Trade Center's stature. The new capital city, accommodating six million people, remains under development leaving the question of whether the Oblisco Capital will indeed claim the title of the world's tallest building by 2030. Number 5. Jeddah Tower, Saudi Arabia Ranked fifth among the world's tallest buildings, the Jeddah Tower, a prominent project within the Jeddah Economic City, is set to soar to an impressive height of at least 3,280 feet and whopping price tag of $1.2 billion. The foundation piles, each as substantial as a small room, with a 10-foot diameter and reaching length of up to 360 feet, lay the groundwork for this monumental structure. The sleek design, resembling three petals inspired by folding desert plant fronds, serves both aesthetic and functional purposes. The building's tapering silhouette not only combats wind resistance and gravitational forces, but also optimizes usable space offsetting the larger core size on lower floors. Jeddah Tower's architectural prowess extends to its 59 elevators and 12 escalators, five of which are double-deckers. To mitigate the impact of high altitudes on elevator speeds, three sky lobbies prevent a single elevator from making the arduous journey to the top, eliminating the need for colossal cables. Sustainability considerations introduce challenges such as vertical transportation limitations, swaying induced by wind, and super column settling due to material differences. Notably, the tower's smooth, sloped exterior design addresses these issues, prioritizing superior aerodynamics over more cost-effective stepped designs. The construction, albeit experiencing delays, resumed in September after interruptions, including the COVID-19 pandemic. As the Jeddah Economic City project progresses, the tower's structural form will seamlessly blend technological innovation with organic design principles. With an elevator system among the world's most advanced, reaching speeds of up to 33 feet per second, and a sky terrace on level 157 offering the world's highest observatory, 
the Jenner Tower stands as a testament to cutting-edge construction and engineering. Number 4. Burj Mubarak Al-Kabir, Kuwait Kuwait made headlines when it unveiled plans for the Burj Mubarak Al-Kabir, set to be the world's tallest tower at an impressive 3,280 feet. Part of the expansive Madinat al Hariya, the Silk City project in Subia, the skyscraper's estimated cost is 82.25 billion US dollars, forming the centerpiece of a 250 square kilometer development that encompasses residential, commercial, and recreational spaces, along with a sprawling central park. With the renowned Spanish architect Santiago Calatrava as the chosen designer, the Burj Mubarak Tower is set to be a 230 floor marvel inspired by traditional Islamic minarets featuring a slender pinnacle. Envisioned to accommodate 7,000 residents, the structure's completion is projected over a 25-year timeline. Its diverse offerings include a hotel, offices, apartments, observation decks, retail spaces and restaurants, aiming to position it as a prominent tourist destination, reflecting Kuwait's aspirations for progress. Despite the ambitious scope of the project, several construction challenges may arise during its execution. Managing the intricacies of erecting a one-kilometer tower demands innovative engineering solutions and rigorous safety measures. Tackling issues such as material transport, structural stability and environmental impact will be paramount to ensuring the success of this groundbreaking endeavor. However, it's essential to note that the Burj Mubarak Al-Kabir, despite its grandeur, faces challenges on another front. It currently stands as a proposed project with no concrete signs of realization. Unfortunately, this towering vision is unlikely to rival the Burj Khalifa as it remains in the realm of proposals, awaiting the transition from plans to reality. Number 3. Azerbaijan Tower, Azerbaijan Ibrahim Ibrahimov, president of the Avesta Group of Companies, envisioned the Azerbaijan Tower reaching an impressive height of approximately 3,448 feet with an astounding 189 floors. This architectural marvel, valued at $2 billion, was poised to be the focal point of the Khazar Islands, an ambitious $100 billion city comprising 41 artificial islands sprawling over 3,000 hectares reclaimed from the Caspian Sea. The visionary city aimed to accommodate 1 million residents and boasted an extensive infrastructure, featuring 150 schools, 50 hospitals and daycare centers, expansive parks, state-of-the-art shopping malls, cultural hubs, university campuses, and even a Formula One caliber racetrack. Notably, all these structures were meticulously designed to withstand seismic activities up to a magnitude 9.0, ensuring the safety and resilience of the city. The comprehensive urban plan included 150 bridges and a substantial municipal airport connecting the islands to the mainland. Ibrahimov revealed that investors from the United States, Turkey, the Arab world and China had already expressed keen interest in this groundbreaking project, foreseeing a city that he likened to a new Venice. Originally scheduled to commence construction in 2015 and wrap up by approximately 2019, the Azerbaijan Tower faced an unfortunate turn of events, leading to the cancellation of this awe-inspiring construction project. So, yes, the Azerbaijan Tower stands no chance in this race. Number 2. Creek Tower, UAE Dubai Creek Tower, unveiled in February 2016, promises to surpass the iconic Burj Khalifa, with initial estimates suggesting a height of 3,045 feet. The tower's architectural significance was emphasized by Santiago Calatrava's son, foreseeing it as a notch taller than Burj Khalifa. In August 2017, a revealing video in Dubai Mall hinted at the staggering height, indicating that eight stacked Dubai Creek towers could reach approximately 11 kilometers, equivalent to a minimum of 1,300 meters. Further intriguing details emerged, suggesting that the cumulative height of five Dubai Creek Towers matches that of eight Burj Khalifa, placing the tower at an estimated 1,345 meters. Despite these extraordinary projections, a potential obstacle to claiming the title of the world's tallest building arises. The Council on Tall Buildings and Urban Habitat, CTBUH, 
defines a structure as a building only if at least 50% of its height is habitable. Here lies a contentious issue as Dubai Creek Tower falls short, with less than 30% being habitable floors. This challenge may hinder the tower's official recognition as the world's tallest. However, the developer and various news outlets are likely to challenge this classification, emphasizing the tower's unprecedented form that diverges significantly from conventional sightseeing towers. Number 1. Sky Mile Tower, Japan The architectural marvel known as Sky Mile Tower takes center stage in the ambitious Next Tokyo 2045 initiative. A collaborative effort by Con Pedersen Fox Associates and Leslie E. Robertson Associates. Envisioned as a resilient beacon in the face of natural disasters, this futuristic edifice stands as the third in the lineup of the world's future tallest buildings. Crafted with meticulous engineering, the tower's design is a testament to forward-thinking urban planning. Its hexagonal-shaped structures, spanning from 500 to 5,000 feet, are strategically layered to mitigate the impact of formidable waves offering a safeguard against the region's seismic and typhoon challenges. The bay-friendly concept extends beyond mere structural fortification. Incorporating innovative features such as water-filled structures for island access, public beach harbors, and urban farming plots. Remarkably, the tower's groundbreaking design includes pre-filled structures, fostering sustainable practices by harnessing salt water from the bay to cultivate renewable and clean fuel sources. Notably, the mile-high Sky Mile Tower, reaching an astonishing 5,577 feet, outstrips the Burj Khalifa, currently the tallest building globally, by twice its height. Within the Sky Mile Tower, a vertical community of 55,000 residents thrives amidst multi-level sky lobbies. These shared spaces house an array of amenities, including shopping centers, restaurants, hotels, gyms, libraries, and health clinics. The hexagonal blueprint, validated through extensive wind tests, emerges as an aerodynamic triumph, ensuring resilience against turbulent weather conditions. Intriguingly, addressing the logistical challenge of supplying water to inhabitants a mile above ground, the architects devised an ingenious facade. This design flawlessly collects, treats, and stores water at various levels, relying on gravity for a natural and efficient distribution system. As the project advances, proponents of Next Tokyo foresee the enhanced waterfront properties in Tokyo Bay as potential contributors to funding this groundbreaking endeavor. The Sky Mile Tower not only aims for unprecedented heights, but also sets a paradigm for sustainable urban living and disaster-resilient architecture on a grand scale. Which of these buildings do you believe will truly stand the test of time and emerge as the world's tallest building? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. We also plead that you support us by liking this video and subscribing now to this channel if you haven't done that already.